Welcome viewers to Softy Demi a software engineering academy today i am going to discuss with you about public site so how to enter your public site in latest version 20.12 this is a latest feature we are just discussing about admin preferences so our admin preferences does not allow in this version they do not allow you to directly launch your website or any public site in primavera p6 so when i open my primavera p6 i will make a scenario i will make a discussion on this scenario that whenever you add a site any link in your primavera p6 anywhere where you can add a text when you launch that text it will not your administrator will not allow you to launch that website the website cannot only be launched when your admin will allow you because there are a lot of sites which allow you to hack your primavera p6 database that's why in this system primavera fixes this issue of hacking so that's why only a few websites which you will allow then that site can be accessed from your project so first of all i will go here in the enterprise and first of all i will just show you how can you add your website here any any link any code you can add for your public site so here i will open my user defined field and i will create my user defined field in activities tab so in activities tab for example i say that i need a website a public site public website public website link so any link you can add for any activity when i add here i right click here go here in the columns and i will just enter here public and it will find my public website link here so i will add add here after the duration cross this one apply okay so here i have added the link you can print this one this link also you can open from your system so one method is this one let's paste my website here so this is my website this is my website of media fire file i have created a link for my media fire file so that's why i paste that one link so we can add here the this file also also where we can add this file right click here customize activities there is wps and documents we add here documents here okay press okay we can add here our documents from here and here i will go in the wps and document i create my document file here my document file and i will go here in the files here is a file option and in below public location i will enter my site here so uh, here i have entered the site here first of all i will try to launch it from here press launch when you press the launch here it's written here for security reason your administrator has denied access to this url contact your administrator to resolve this issue so it's saying that contact with your administrator so if you are a stand alone a user if you do not have access with admin preferences you cannot go for this solution so if you are using stand alone you can go to your admin preferences so also i will show you go here in the activities and when i click right click here launch this hyperlink so when i launch this hyperlink it's also appearing the same option so i will tell you more places where we can add this one this column in the projects we can add here from at enterprise here and go here below for user defined fields here user defined field open and i will go here in the projects and i can add here the same link website link web link web link we can add here web link and close this one and right click here and we can go here in the columns and customize here and here i will search for web web link also there is also project web link also there is available project project web site link also here you can add here custom and anything you want to be no issue so apply okay this one is a text column so this one is a web link you can right click here and you can add here paste this one so this is also paste here when you go here launch 
launch this one hyperlink it's also appearing the same option also you can go here in the resources you can add here this one in resources all the user defined field here when you go here in the user defined fields and there all the options where you can add this column this column can be added in the resources risk wps wps products and documents into wps also it can be added in issues everywhere in activity steps and activity resource assignments everywhere this document this uh, column can be added so you can add the text column and you can paste your link there and you can right click and launch the hyperlink so i will go back there i will remove that one column from here it will be go to our default so we will not appear this one again apply okay so i will go here in the activities so here i have added my public website link so when i go here and right click i will launch this hyperlink it it's not working so what i will do i will go here in the copy copy hyperlink and right when i go here right click and copy this hyperlink i will go here and add admin admin then admin preferences there is admin preferences you can see the first option when i click on admin preferences there is a top journal and the last bottom is exception site list so here i have to add my site list when i go here and add and i will click here control v here now i have added the site here i will close this one option now when i go here in the media file right click here and launch the site now you will see my site is now launched here the media file is now launched here i also cross this one and go here quiet this one and also i will go here in the wps same i will launch from here this one will be launched from here also so everywhere this site only this site can be launched because i have added this site in exception site list if you go here in the admin and go here in the admin preferences i will remove enable option and then i will close this one and launch again the option will be appear here again only the site which is added in exception list of your admin preferences is able to launch from your Primavera P6 database. So Primavera P6 data is base is very secure for every person which who want to add the links here. So you can go here and enable that content. When you click this one, enable this one and close this one. You can see here it will launch again. Press this one launch option. You will see update progress using activity steps. This one site launched which i have put you can only put all the sites like www.google.com if you all uh, already put that one it will also appear that one any site which can be hyperlink will be appear from there also you can add that columns this defined user defined field columns in everywhere in your activities resources and everywhere so thanks for watching software demi this was our today's content about the exceptional site list in admin preferences setting admin preferences setting you can add your sites exception list to secure your database and to secure your software so this is our today's content thanks for watching soft demi like share and comment don't forget to press the bell icon and give us a feedback we will come up with new videos